On them shall be no fear, nor shall they grieve. Don't get stressed out, Muslims, over things that haven't happened yet. That's fear. And don't get stressed out over things that's already happened. Everything has been decreed. The most difficult pill for the Muslims to swallow is article number six of our deen, the qadr of Allah. We don't want to admit it. We have to give each other a reminder. Allah gave us the name insan. Insan literally translated means the creature that has to be reminded. Because out of everything that Allah created, we're the only one that forgets. We forget about the power of Allah. We forget about the presence of Allah. We forget that we came from a clot and we were nothing. And yet we look down on others. We come to Juma prayer every single week and many times sit next to the same brother or sit to the, next to the same sister and never even ask their name. We don't care with the prophet that taught us how to love and continues to teach us and correct us to this day. The prophet that had the least amount to work with, but the biggest job of all the prophets combined. He had to teach us and still teaches us, read the seerah, Achi. He has to teach us how to wear our clothes, how long, how short, how to wear our beard, how to laugh, how to cry, how long to cry, how loud to laugh, how to drink water, how to drink milk, what to say before we go to bed, what to say when we wake up, subhanAllah. How to please our wives, how to teach our children, when to pray, when not to pray, how to break our fast, every single thing he had to correct. All the other prophets had a specific task or a specific group of people to talk to and a specific thing that they had to correct. Muhammad ibn Abdullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam had to correct everything because we weren't doing anything right, including how to respect and love each other. And we get so afraid because we forget. We fear and we forget that Allah is in control.